Hi, this is Gary from MacMost Now. Today I want to tell you about some quick, easy, and free screen capture software. So while I was at the Blog World Expo in Las Vegas this last weekend, I came across the TechSmith booth. They're mostly known for their Camtasia software on Windows, which hopefully will soon be coming to Mac. But they already have a Mac product and it's called Jing. Jing is really easy to use screen capture software. I'll let Katie from TechSmith explain. We were using our existing application Snagit in Camtasia Studio to do a lot of screen recording and screen video record, screen video recording and screen capture. And we, um, we thought, well, geez, wouldn't it be awesome if you could just easily share this information instead of having to produce a file, save it, put it in an email, attach it, send it, send the file, and have someone download it, and then watch watch the video or open the link, open the image. And so we thought, all right, well, we have this this technology. All we need to do is just make it easy and just have the share button. So the developers went to work and they created the product that's now called Jing Project and um, very simple, easy to share, and we were using it so much we thought, well, geez, wouldn't everyone else love to use a product like this? And visual communication is something we feel really strongly about, so we wanted to get Jing out there and help people be able to uh, visually communicate instead of just explaining everything in words. So check out Jing. So Jing has a pretty unique interface. It's got this little sun that appears on your desktop and you can move it around to the corners of your screen or the sides or the top and you can go ahead and roll over it and then click on the capture button. Then you define an area you want to capture. So if you want to show somebody something in the preferences here, you can select an area and then you select if you want to do an image or video or whatever. You do the image. Once you do draw the image, it grabs it and now you can draw stuff on it. Like you can draw an arrow and write a piece of text, that type of thing. And When you're finished, you can decide where to save it. You can even save it to a free service called Screencast.com from TechSmith that puts it up and creates a place for you to share things. You can also save it to your Flickr account or your own FTP server or just to a file. Same options are available for video. Jing is very easy to use and when you share something with somebody it's actually done in Flash format. So it's going to be widely available and cross-platform. Unfortunately, of course, it also saves as a flash format when you save files locally, so it's not going to be as useful for doing something uh, you want to put into an iMovie movie or use in another way. So everything about Jing is about making it really easy, the least number of steps, the easiest way to share something. So if you want to point out something to a friend, you can send them a quick screenshot of what you mean or do a really quick video. So it's all about ease of use, not necessarily features. The best thing about Jing is it's free, so you might as well download it and try it. You can go ahead and find it at jingproject.com. Till next time, this is Gary Rosenzweig with MacMost Now.